different teams. Okay. And then you have various traps. That's These are traps. Do. These are the traps to, cons to trap the dog. And again, I have to defer to my colleagues to tell you how they work. Are they all the same type? Or? Guys? They're the same type, right? They're the same type of traps. Yes, these are uh, light traps. They're just a little trap for adult mosquitoes. They're like a requested by any mosquitoes. They're like a mosquitoes that aren't already in the So these will be set up at uh, ports and airports? That's correct. Throughout the district. So they'll have light and they attract mosquitoes yes. in, and then they analyze what kind of mosquitoes they are. Using the microscopes. So we hope that we don't get those malaria mosquitoes. Exactly. Right. And the point of entry at the airports and the and obviously the ports, uh, ship ports are obviously where those mosquitoes would be introduced. So this is your first level of defense, the surveillance piece. Very important. So it will be all at the airports and all the ports. Eh? Thank you very much for this. It's our honor, sir. It's been such a privilege, and it's been very gratifying working with your team. You're very great. Thank you. The other insect. It has been very educational for me, and for me, I'm very grateful to the U.S. Embassy, to the U.S. Navy, and to the U.S. government for helping us out in this way, and helping us out in getting all of this equipment, the lovely equipment that is there, that is going to. And not only for that, for all the things that you talked about, all the different training programs, the uh, things that you hope to be able to do with our people here. You've also talked about the importance of seeing whether we can help out the other little countries in the region. And that is something that Fiji's always been prepared to do. And as you all know, mosquitoes have been a scourge of this country. They have led to a lot of deaths in the past. It's something that we're trying to fight against right now. And I've, uh, I endorse the words you talked about, collaboration, cooperation, communication, those are things that we believe in. And we know that in a small country like Fiji, we never have all the things that we need, not, not in terms of knowledge, not in terms of uh, resources. So the fact that you're here to give this donation and to work with our people, to build our capacities so we can strengthen the way in which we can protect our own people is something that we really appreciate. And I'm not going to speak uh, too long. A lot of the things that I had here are things that you talked about. But mosquitoes and vector-borne diseases, we, you know that dengue is now endemic in this country. They tell me that it used to be cyclical. Now dengue has decided not to be cyclical. It's just here all the time. So we need to be on our toes. Uh, we've had the Fight the Bite campaign last year when we had this uh, onset of, uh, what was the new one that came on board? Zika. Zika, now that I hear that Zika has now gone up to about 37 cases, so we have a concern with that. We need to get our people to be active, to be working on this, and people need to be trained up and aware of this, so we're very, very, very appreciative of this. I want you to know personally, from the Ministry of Health and Medical Services, we really appreciate the effort that you put in. Please convey that to the Ambassador and to the rest of the people in the in the, and to the Navy and to all of you. We will make sure that we'll make use of these things. All the suggestions that you have made, about us working together in, uh, to help with the region, inviting other people to be part of the training programs that you talked about, that is something that we will definitely do. So I hope that the staff are listening and taking care and taking note of these things. We need in this country too to work with the media. We need to be able to work with us in spreading the gospel about the things that we need to do about vector control. We're in the cold season now, it's going to get warm very soon and the creepy crawlies will start coming out again. So together as a country, we need to make sure that we are protected at the borders, but together as a country, we will work to make sure that we can control our vectors. So that's all I'm going to say. For all of us in Fiji, thank you. May God bless you. May you have a lot more success. And we will work with you in Fiji and in the region. Thank you. Nawali. Thank you, Honorable Minister.